Hello to everybody watching Pops and Soul. It's Park Seung Hyun. I recently released a new single, and it's called Yonejun, which I think you can translate as being in a relationship. Um, it's an R&B ballad, and I haven't done R&B in a, a long time, so it was quite a challenge for me. And it sounds like a happy song, Yonejun, I'm in a relationship, but it's actually about a relationship that's got some problems in it. Uh, I think it's something that everybody can um, relate to. It's when the romance is gone and everything becomes habit. That's the kind of feel it has to the song. It's got this sort of um, contemplative style to it. Originally wanted to do an entire album and come out with an album, but I just, I found this song and we were working on it and I just loved it so much. I thought it was just so cool and modern that I just, I didn't want to hold on to it and wait for an entire album to be made. So I decided to release it as a single this time around. Uh, I haven't been able to actually sit down, go into the recording studio and record new music because I've been so busy either doing concerts or other television programs. And so, yeah, my music life had been just taken in a different direction. So it's wonderful to come back out with a new original song. I hadn't really been in the, inside the recording studio to really record a new song in a while, so it was weird to not be singing live. When you sing live on stage, a lot of your performance is in the moment, almost ad-lib, just kind of following your instincts. And so I had fallen into those habits. And then going back to the recording studio was sort of difficult because everything has to be very calculated. Every little part of the song has to be very well thought out. So it took a while to record the song. I actually came back to the studio, I think maybe three separate times to fix this and fix that. I would sing it once uh, and do one session, take it home. The songwriter and I would listen to it uh, just constantly. Then we'd come back, make notes, change a few things, change some, actually change some lyrics too. So it was a really long and detailed process and um, I guess it was sort of, kind of like a refresher course for me to go back into the studio.